Firefighting is one of the best adventures you could ever undertake. It takes a lot of commitment and a lot of heart. But you never know what's going to happen next. To me, that's what makes a good adventure. When you're on the front line of one of nature's fiercest forces, you're seeing Mother Nature up close, and it's, it's really incredible. It's awe-inspiring. It's otherworldly. In the morning, the fire's laying down, the smoke is rising, the sun is shining through the smoke, creating these beautiful light rays, and everything is calm. And then, once it gets hotter and drier, the winds pick up, and you start noticing the fire start to come alive. And next thing you know, it can be running through the trees, sounding like a freight train. It's just amazing. You feel so small and helpless when these trees, 150 feet tall, are burning all around you. Ooh, it's gets hot. The men and women who join fire crews and fight fire all summer fit my personality like a glove. They're hardworking, they love the outdoors, they love the camaraderie of being with others, and they have a taste for adventure. They don't mind being dirty and grubby and smoky and going for days and days without a shower. They have a thirst for adventure, and they love it. It's a big job. It's a fun job. You get to come out here and, and uh, play with fire. You know, in fire, like I've said before, you never know what's going to happen next. and. We were on the side of this hillside, and I was shooting firefighters on this part of the fire where it was kind of lying down. The fire was pretty much out, and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, an airplane flies right over top of us, and we look up, and the sky is pink, and it's falling. It's 2,500 gallons of fire retardant being dumped right on us. This stuff is like French dressing. It's horrible consistency, and we got a direct hit. It put the fire right out. It covered me from head to toe. Some days nothing will happen, and then something absolutely unpredictable happens like that. Yeah, I've been in situations where it was very hot, and there were homes burning down all around me, and it's a scary thing because usually you always know a place you can go to where there's nothing burning. But I was on the street, and there were homes burning everywhere. There was no cold side, so to speak. There was no way I could back away from it. And that was when I decided it was time to leave. I got my pictures that I needed, and it was time to move on. The people who do it, they love it. It's something that isn't unlike anything else. And you're going to be seeing things that could be the highlight of your life. It's an incredible adventure. It's something well worth doing. <laughs>